This In Pit Lane News Update is proudly brought to you by Dino Dynamics, the leading makers of performance dynamometers. And with the assistance of the All Seasons Phillip Island Resort, your place to stay at Phillip Island. With over 50 cars on the grid, the start of the Q one-hour sports car race made for a spectacular sight as the field streamed down towards Bass Strait for the first time. Not everyone would finish, of course. Ivan Klassen, an early casualty, retiring his awesome 944 Turbo on lap 8. Ross Lilly and the Viper led early, but the class of the field was Alan Simonson who stormed through from 6th place to set a new lap record and give the Dane and car owner Ted Hugland their second win in the event. This is my favourite event uh, and uh, it's become one of Alan's favourites too. Um, as he said, we've, this is the second time we've won it and we should have won it once before only for a Ferrari doing what Ferraris sometimes do breaking an, an axle with a half a lap to go but uh, yeah I love the race and uh, uh, as a member of uh, Pi Arc I uh, you know, love to win the home race. Alan you said on the show last week that this uh, it was a favourite being able to run with Ted I mean how good is it to win with him? Well it's very good but uh, we, we try to set out to try and win too so uh, we know we've got a fast car we've got a good team preparing the car so um, we set out to win we won it before as Ted said and it's important for us to, uh, to come down here and do a good job. Monaro driver Michael Robinson wrapped up the Victorian State Sports Dan Championship in style, clinching the title with a win in this year's biggest race. Robinson led all the way to win the All Seasons Resort 50k plate, the premier race for local sports sedans. Dean Cam pressured Robbo early, but when he ran wide at the hairpin formerly known as Honda, his challenge was over. He later retired from the race with mechanical problems. New South Wales driver David McGuinness in his V8 Calibra took over the challenge, but he was soon under pressure from the flying Chaz Talbot in the Commodore. Phil Webster and Damian Johnson had a race-long battle, but despite this pass by Johnson, Webster would finally come out on top. Talbot disposed of McGuinness and was flying, but he couldn't catch Robinson, who went on to win both the race and the 2011 state title. And in Formula V, National Series winner Daniel Reynolds joined the locals for a great race and a win in the prestigious Murray Fordham Trophy race.